For me, the strenuous life is over. I am a time-expired man. I am emancipated. No compulsions for me, nor any bugle call, but lights out. Now, when invited out, I may forever lay aside the plea of a previous engagement, which for forty years has cost me so many twinges. On this side of the grave, I will never again need this common lie of politeness. Instead, if the invitation causes me to shrink at the thought of night and winter, the late homecoming from the banquet, the lights and the laughter through the deserted streets, and if I am reminded that there's no need to creep in a tiptoe, for my friends never more can be disturbed. If I shrink at thought of these things, then I need only reply, in truth, your invitation honors and pleases me because you still keep me in your remembrance. But I am seventy, seventy, and would nestle in the chimney corner and smoke my pipe and read my book and take my rest. Wishing you well in all affection, and that when you, in your turn, arrive at pier number 70, you may step aboard your waiting ship with a reconciled spirit and lay your course toward the sinking sun with a contented heart. <laughs>